Hello everyone. I hope you are all doing well. I am also fine. Today I am going to show you how you can uh, deploy a React.js application into WHM cPanel. So let's get started. This is a React application that is uh, in my local host and I'm going to deploy it to a dev server. What I'm going to do is uh, let me get pull to the latest version. So it's already updated. Then I'm going to run a uh, yarn build. This will create a build for this React application. And this build, we will uh, compress it, make a zip file and upload it to the WHMC panel. So it might take one or two minutes time, so let's be patient. While it's getting the build, let me tell you that uh, for uploading the React build to WHM uh, or cPanel, you might face some issues with URL redirect. So what you have to do is add a uh, .htaccess file into the public folder with this as an option. So I will give this up as a uh, comment inside the comment so that you can just copy and paste it inside your public folder with the .ht access and it should fix the issue of URL redirect. Okay, my build is been completed. So let me go to the build directory. Sorry. Let me go to the build directory. This is the build directory. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to Copy all the files here. Make a zip. Okay. The zip has been completed. Let's go to WHMC panel. This is WHMC panel. This is the folder. I'm going to upload the zip file here. Projects build. There's the zip file that I've created. Let's upload that. Build size is around 27 megabytes, so that might take around one or two minutes time. So let's wait. Meanwhile, uh, at this moment, there's no file. So if I check the domain, it's, it will give you an error because there's no file here. However, once we upload the build, extract the build into that folder, it should uh, show the React applications. Let's pause the video for a minute. Okay, so we are almost done. It's 97%. It's almost there. So it's 100% just waiting to be making this as a green. So I can I can extract it. Yeah, that's it. So this is fine now. So let's back. 
to the file manager, reload this, click here and click extract. Reload this page. And uh, now if I refresh here, I should be able to see the website is up and running. So uh, this is a, a quick tutorial for uh, those who wants to upload their React applications to WHM cPanel. Uh, remember to add a .htaccess file in your public folder. Otherwise, you might have some issues with URL redirecting. For example, um, if there is any page which is uh, like not uh, having any real page, but it's virtually redirecting, you need to have .htaccess for Apache. Okay, it's still loading, just a moment. So that's loaded fine. I hope this all works fine. So this is a quick, very easy tutorial. If you like this video, please subscribe to my channel and uh, I will create more videos similar like this. Thank you, have a nice day, bye-bye.